Okay, here we are dealing with difference in faculty in humanities between male and female. So now the key here is to go to humanities field. And we want to look here for the number of males. And that will, of course, allow us to contrast out the number of females to get the percent of males. So how many males do we have? Well, we have 250 males total. And in humanities, we have 14% of that. So what is 14%? of 250. Well, what's 10% of 250? That's 25. 4% of 250 is 10, so that gives us 35 males. And how many females do we have? Well, the number of females is, if you look here, it says there are 17% of 200. So you double 17%, you get 34 females. And you can see there's slightly more males than females, therefore, we look at the answer choices, the one that's slightly more is 51%. It's basically half, but a little bit in favor of males, so the answer is E. Now, really quickly, you may wonder, well, how did I do? How did I end up getting 35 from here? Now, an important thing to remember is you don't have to always get exact numbers, especially if you look at the answer choices. For instance, it may be easier, and I'm going to bring this over here, 15% of 250 is what? Well, we know that 10% of 250, just move this over, is 25. Half of 25 will give you 5%, which is 12.5. Now we know we can't obviously have a half a male. But you can see already that 37.5 is greater than 34. So when we go a little bit above, just 1% more, we go all the way up to 37.5. So 1% less than that is still probably going to be greater than 34. And so you know there have to be more males than there are females. So the only answer that works is E. 51%.